Hello everybody, Dustin here, and I found some awesome rocks. Um, we went to a location in Washington County with the St. Louis Mineral and Gem Society and really scored on Drew's Quartz. This is one of the pieces I got. And like a total nut job, I'm gonna power wash these today. I think there's some crystals on the back there too, some ice crystals. <laughs> Hope I don't freeze, but these pieces are going to be amazing once I get them cleaned up and um, I can't wait till spring, so hope I don't freeze. All right, this place is crazy. I've already found some awesome stuff. Um, this whole dam of this lake here is just loaded with Drews. Like this right here, you can probably see the agate bands on that from there. Oh, I see some crystals. Check this out. All of this is just sitting around here. Look at that. Awesome. All right. I got to keep looking here. I'm in heart. there boys and girls would you like to come on a wonderful trip with me All right, so check this out, you guys. I saw this rock here, and I flipped it over, and splud out! Look at that! Look at all those crystals. This one, definitely coming home with me. This is an epic plate. This is so cool. Dude, I just want to keep looking here. I found such cool stuff here. Oh, this might be a good one. Oh. And here's the messed up thing. I'm not even sure if this is cool enough to come home with me, which is just crazy. Oh, I hope I'm able to get back to this location someday. This is absolutely epic. All right, just found a cool little plate that's gonna come home with us. That's got some weird formations on it and check this out what's that look at those crystals hiding out there let's pull that one out and see what we got eh, i think it's got some overgrowth on it so i don't know i may not bring that one home oh i don't want to lose this cool little one 
Yeah, so I don't know. Maybe that one's not cool enough. Uh, still pretty cool. Wow. Check out the agate bands. It's awesome. Tried to clean it off with my gloves and got it more dirty. Ooh. He's candy. that right up out of the ground you can see how beautiful that's going to be this spot is just crazy crazy good this makes all other Drew's Quartz locations look like a joke yeah look at this baby seriously this is cooler than Arkansas you guys this is the ultimate they're just everywhere they're absolutely everywhere we're just stepping on get more crystals look at that just sitting right here that's crazy dude like normally I would be all over a piece like this and I'm not even sure if it's cool enough to take back there's so much good stuff here what'd you find um some cruisy quartz definitely gonna keep these ones dude they were right next to each other just upside down in the dirt show the other side and this is what they look like upside down I get banding good find Thank you. Down the hill on the other side of the dam. Oh yeah, that's a nice one. That's gorgeous. Good find. <laughs> Thank you. See any smoky on those tips? I don't know if you can. I'd have to do some acid soaking in the future. These are cool though. Oh, you can see it's got some cool agate bands on it. Very cool piece. Missouri Lace Agate Drew's Quartz. This is some of the best of the best of this material, I think. Beautiful pieces. Ah, I'm looking fabulous today. This one's next. It's going to look a lot different here in a minute. Some man, so much dirt on here, but you can see it's gonna have a lot of the cool banding, also. At least if it's not in shadow, you can see. Let's do it. picks of the day everything's all cleaned up I got it power washed off um, as usual some of the pieces that I came back with were kind of disappointing but others ended up being more of a surprise than I thought um, got lots of different stuff lots of big Jimmy crystals and lots with these cool kind of stalactite formations yeah, this one's cool here, like with the little stalactites coming up.
So awesome day, rock hounding. I'm probably gonna soak these in acid. Get some of that orange oxide staining off. Yeah, these are the, some of those cool stalactite pieces. This one had a lot of cool rehealed sections that I thought was interesting. I like the rehealed pieces. This one I thought was going to be kind of one of those Jimmy Smoky burrs. This was all covered in mud and I could only see the backside. This one was kind of a surprise. It was kind of a, had this purple botroidal fine druze thing going. There's another piece that I found. There were some bigger pieces of this too, but I didn't pick any up because I went for the stalactites and the big crystals. Some really big crystals here from Missouri. Some of the points on some of these pieces almost remind me of Arkansas. Lots of just really weird formations. I wonder if maybe there's a biological component to these, like maybe microbial mats that the crystals grow over give them this weird structure. I don't know, that's just speculation, but very cool looking, very interesting formations. This one here too. Oh, can you see it? There's kind of a little bridge there. Got a couple like that with those little bridge structures. Here, this one. You can see it better, I think. Yeah, there's a couple of them. So very cool, very cool finds. This is one that my son Cash found. I think this piece is really, really cool. The lighter colored crystals in there are barite, I'm pretty sure. It's got some fantastic agate banding. Very cool piece found by my son Cash. I was looking for pieces like this with the stalactite formations and he found the best one. So I think we killed it. Let me know what you guys think.